It's time for predictions. That's right, this Sunday, Clash of Champions. We're all going to be watching COC. C C I can't say that. That's not PG. Who put that in there? Who put that in the script? Who's a... Okay, you're fired. All right, predictions. Let's get down to business. Her business is up first because the US title is on the line. Bob Lashley defends against Apollo Crews. I'm picking Bob Lashley to retain because I feel like the Hurt Business need a title, a championship within their group to make them seem more legit. So Big Bob gonna win. Next, the Raw tag team titles on the line. Street Profits against A and A, Andrade and Angel. Those guys are my pick to win. A and A, double A, getting the W on Sunday because it's about time they won the tag team titles, I think. They've been a team, they haven't been a team, they're back together. Yeah, it's about time. It's about time. Smackdown tag team titles. Cesaro and Nakamura defend against Lucha House Party. The Lucha House Party is kind of a team of jobbers. Ooh. Let's be honest, they lose a lot. Will they win on Sunday? This match could go either way, but I'm going to stick with the champs, Cesaro, Nakamura. I feel like they are bigger stars than the Lucha House Party, and they're a good team. Keep the belts on them. Sure. The women's tag team titles. Up next, Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler defend against the Riot Squad, minus Sarah Logan. Who? Liv Morgan and Ruby Riot. This is the same as Andrade and Angel. You know, it's a team that are back together, they split up, they're now friends again. So you know what? I'm gonna say they win on Sunday. I feel like Shayna and Nia are gonna have some sort of falling out, some miscommunication, and the Riot Squad finally winning some gold in WWE. Liv and Ruby, new women's tag team champions. Oh, baby. This match is gonna be good. The Intercontinental Championship match, triple threat ladder match. Champion Jeff Hardy defends against AJ Styles and Sami Zayn. Oh my, this thing is going to be good. I can't wait. This is probably the match I'm most looking forward to. But who is going to win? It could go three ways. That's how triple threat matches work. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to go with my gut feeling, instinct. I'm going to say the man walking out of Clash of Champions with the title will be the man that never lost it in the first place. Sami Zayn, he's gonna wait for the right moment. Jeff is down, AJ is down. Sami Zayn gonna up the ladder, grab his belt that he never lost, and once again, be IC champion. SmackDown women's title up next. Bailey defends against Nikki Cross. What about Sasha Banks? What about Alexa Bliss? There's lots of moving pieces in this match. And how is it all going to play out? I think the only person beating Bailey for this title is going to be Sasha. So Bailey wins on Sunday with help from Nikki. What? With help from Sasha? I don't know. Bailey wins. Whatever happens, Bailey's going to win. Raw women's title. Asuka defends against Zelina Vega. Zelina, how many matches has she actually had? Not very many. So. She's not going to win, having just three or four matches, especially against Asuka. No way. Ain't going to happen. So Asuka, the Empress of Tomorrow, the Empress of Sunday, retains. <laughs> Ambulance match is up next for the WWE title. Drew McIntyre against Randy Orton, and I think it's time. I do think it's time that Drew loses. Now, 
he's kind of protected because he's not going to get pinned. He's not being submitted. So losing in an ambulance match isn't the worst way to lose. You have to put your opponent into the ambulance and close the doors. So I can see Randy Orton becoming, what, 14, 13, 15 time champion? And I think he's winning it again on Sunday because it's an ambulance match. Doesn't hurt Drew that much. And maybe we can revisit Drew winning the title when there's crowds back. So we can get a big reaction for Drew. That's what I'm seeing happening. And finally, the universal title, Roman Reigns against his cousin, Jey Uso. The question is not who's going to win. The question is how long will this last? Because Roman is going to absolutely destroy Jey Uso. Of course, he's winning. He's retaining. Paul Heyman in his corner cackling like the evil genius that he is. Jey Uso, please book a hospital bed prepared for Sunday because you are going to get beaten, battered, broken by the big dog. So guys, those are my Clash of Champions predictions. Let me know yours in the comments below. What do you think of my predictions? Am I right? Am I wrong? Am I stupid? Probably yes. But we will find out Sunday what the hell happens. I'll be watching. Make sure you watch as well. Thanks for watching this video. Hit the like, hit subscribe, and I'll see you all very soon for some Clash of Champions. COC. Take that out the script. It, I can't say that. <laughs>